What's up guys? I'm here with Igor. We're vis he's visiting from Belgium. Um, thought I'd throw him in a video. He trains with me in Bikwi Jiu Jitsu over there and uh, attends a lot of my seminars. I've stayed at his house. Awesome guy. MMA fighter. Um, purple belt, Bikwi Jiu Jitsu. Anyhow, we were going over some footlock defense and just stance in I had these guys doing events and they're doing basics, so I'm gonna go over some things, right? Put me in Ashi, like, so like my, my stance, just in general stance, I wanna have my elbow on my hip and my hand right here for a couple reasons. One, you can't, oh, hold the Ashi, put your, push the Ashi on, right? I'm just trying to turn it, there you go. He can't put his, his foot quite on my hip, which he wants to do to put me in that position, right? To escape it, I would be pushing with my elbow and squatting low. Why do I want to squat low? Because if I just push his leg off, he's going to go to X guard. He's going to do that immediately. So if I like crush the space here, it's now harder for him to get to X guard, right? So my posture here, he's in the Ashi position. Say I, say I block it and push it off. I, I, I can do this as well. This is more open. This isn't, this isn't, this is a little bit different, okay? Which is good, I'm not knocking it. I'm just saying this is a style. So I have my hand here, and I'm able to squat and grab the head, and grab the elbow, okay? And grab the head this way and balance, whatever you need to do. All right, so I have that. The other reason that I have my elbow here is because it gets insistent on the reap. I have my forearm straight up, same side of the leg that he's reaping. I gave a grip over the top, and I dropped my elbow. It's a really sharp tap. I've popped a lot of feet with it. Some people don't recognize it. You want to hold it with your training partners. I had a guy kick me out before. You want to, you want to, you're okay. Even right here, like if he tries to reap right here, it's the same exact thing. I'm here like this. Pop, I will pop his foot so fast. He's not getting an ankle lock from there. Even if he was heel hooking me, I, I honest to God think I would break his foot like this. Bow! If it had to be a race of who was actually going to tap him. It's that violent of a technique. Okay, so that forearm stays here out of habit to block the foot on the hip and to attack the reap, right, on the, on the foot or, or, or on the ground or on standing up. So what we're doing today was squatting low, getting the shoulder and the elbow and falling two different ways for the omoplata, to attack the omoplata from here. This one, I'm gonna drop my, my leg in like this. A little bit different than the next one. So I grab the shoulder. Once I drop to the side, it's a, my knees are pinched, I'm already, I'm, my elbow's already right here, still able to defend, try and put your foot back in Ashi, right? Stuff like that. It's a matter of me getting my shin through. Once my shin gets through, now it's an omoplata. So you can get up, stand up, or get in the fight like this. I'm gonna continue to chase the omoplata, break him down, start to attack, right? Push the leg in. So I'm here, squat, hands on the shoulder. You can cheat it up a little bit right here. Slide it up a little bit, drop in, shoot the omo. Come out and start attacking. All right, so that's a pretty cool attack. Then we have a second one, which is dropping the other way. Sometimes it's your balance. Sometimes it's the way you want to attack. So I'm going to kind of fall back like this, all right? And then eventually I'm going to go like that. Okay. So I'm here, compression. Again, I can shoot a little bit through. And then as I fall, I'm still trying to shoot through. On this one, I go to my head and my shoulder, and I can attack an awesome triangle. Or I can stay on the omoplata and try to omoplata him through, like if he comes up, boom, right? Or I swing my legs out and take the sweep, and I land the omo, omoplata. I can attack the baby arm, you know. So you have both versions, right? Come back again, but. Uh, let's probably take our arms up this way. Yep. So I'm here, boom. get a little bit through, follow my shoulder back, I can do it like this, or you can come up. Last but not least. Right, he's here, I'm gonna take the sweep that way. Some options for attacking a footlock off the single X. 